Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up Microsoft Office 365 email webmail with uh, Windows Live Mail and I'm, I'm talking about the desktop client that you can download so that means if you want to log in to check your email you don't have to go online into the browser you can just uh, click the start button uh, you can type in live mail or Windows Live or whatever and up pops the client, the server. Okay, so let's just quickly look at the Outlook web app and uh, you can see a few emails have been received already. I sent this one earlier on a test email to darren at smallbizgeek.co.uk so what we want to do is search for Windows Live Essentials. I've already got the website up here but let me just do a Google search for Windows Live Essentials. There it is, that's the link. You can download that. It's free. So what we want to do now is open up Windows Live. I've already got it open and we want to go to options and then email accounts and then what we want to do is click add email account and what you do now is enter your email address so let me just enter mine darren at smallbizgeek.co.uk and enter your password I copy and pasted my password uh, from a notepad but you would type yours in or, or paste it in and then choose your display name either your first name or your last name or if you're a business a brand or whatever you would enter whatever you want your display name to be okay so then we go manually configure the settings and where it says server type select IMAP and just underneath it says server address type outlook dot office 365 dot com and change that port to 993 and we also want to click that it requires a secure connection SSL authenticate using clear text leave that as is and log on username basically re-enter your email address so let's just type it again dot co dot uk right outgoing server information server address so we need to type s m t p dot office 365 dot com requires a secure connection ssl and requires authentication and click next darren at smallbizgeek .co.uk was added and you can add more accounts if you want to okay so I'm going to close up and now this is a bit where we have to wait a, a little while now the messages don't actually show up immediately you have to just give it a few seconds so at the moment it's saying there's no items to view but hello there it is it's appeared and let's click that and look that's the same email that we were looking at earlier in the app this is this is the browser based app and this is the desktop app so there you go that's all you have to do thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video it'd be cool if you would subscribe and uh, I'll post more useful videos thanks bye